Insight into grueling fitness regime facing Tottenham players over international break. The international break could not have come at a better time for Antonio Conte. The Italian has only been Tottenham boss for just over a week and has, thanks to having to play on a Thursday and Sunday, had little time to actually work with his players on the training pitch. Granted, several of Spurs' top stars like Harry Kane and Hyung Min Son have now joined up with their countries for the break, but there are still a good chunk of players left back in England for the next two weeks. This should give Conte a good chance to instill some of his playing style into a decent amount of Spurs' squad. It also looks set to give Conte and his staff a chance to improve the Tottenham players' fitness. The Evening Standard have published a report on Tuesday that provides an insight into the grueling fitness regime set to be facing Spurs players when they return to the training field on Wednesday after being given Monday and Tuesday off. The Italian's schedule for the next two weeks includes a number of days of double training sessions at Spurs training ground and is set to focus above all on conditioning. The S add that three of Conte's six core staff are conditioning specialists, adding that Spurs can expect to return to being one of the fittest sides in the PL. One of these staff members is Gian Piero Ventran, who was nicknamed the Marine by Juventus's squad back in the 90s. As well as being nicknamed the Marine, Ventran's approach has also given rise to three mottos, which highlight just how hard he works his players. These are work today to run tomorrow, die but finish and victory belongs to the strong. There is also a fairly infamous story about Ventran from the 90s, which is mentioned by the S, but was also highlighted in Michael Cox's zonal marking book. Said story goes that Gianluca Vialli, a Juventus player between 1992-96, became so enraged with Ventran and his fitness regimes that he once locked him in a cupboard and called the police. So, it is fair to say that Spurs players are quite clearly set to become